Crashes, corrections, and bear markets are an integral part of equity investing. It's very important during those periods that investors keep their discipline. Maya Statman, the behavioral scientist, says you need to remember that timing your exit from the market and then your re-entry is extremely difficult. People see trading as the equivalent of playing tennis against a training wall. That is really very, very easy. You can place yourself just right to hit the ball right. But but trading is like playing tennis against Djokovic. You know, he pretends to hit it to the left and then hits it to the right just as you go to the wrong uh, spot. And so every time you feel like now is the time to sell or buy more, uh, you have to ask yourself, who is the idiot on the other side of the trade? What do you know that other people, professionals, do not know? And the answer, the true answer for most people, most of the time is nothing. Investors are often influenced by the financial media when markets are volatile. The problem is that people who come across as experts may be completely wrong. If you watch CNBC, have you noticed that there are two experts, both wearing suits, so you know that they are experts, uh, yet one says the market is going to go up and the other says the market is going to go down. And so you know that neither of them knows anything, that they are just making guesses, uh, perhaps by tossing a coin. Uh, and so if you just look at it uh, and you just uh, listen or rather watch CNBC with the voice off, uh, then, then you will be fine. For Maya Statman, it's when markets have fallen that having a financial advisor you can turn to is especially valuable. Part of their job, if you like, is to stop you making a foolish decision. The first line of defense uh, is to recognize that you don't know anything more than others. And just because you feel bad and panicky, there is no reason for you to sell. Uh, but uh, if this is not sufficient, then financial advisors are the second line of defense and they can reason with people and explain precisely what we are talking about uh, and say, look, I understand what panic is. I understand what fear is. This is natural to me too. My advantage over you is that I have learned things uh, that I am now teaching you uh, and therefore, this is a good advice. This is a good piece of advice. Don't do anything or wait two weeks uh, to see if you can cool down and change your mind. In short, then, it's perfectly natural to feel a sense of discomfort when the value of your investments falls sharply. But there are ways of dealing with it rationally.